Amen, amen. This is your girl, Kathy Brock for LUTG Radio, and I'm back. <laughs> All right, so we got segment two. It is 7:31 in the a.m., y'all. And I'm so glad that you came back. I'm happy that you're sticking with me. Amen. And I just wanted to know. I just wanted to say thank you and I'll let you know that um, it's about uh, it's 48 degrees in the shy today. It's supposed to get up to be 79 degrees. Um, sunny, clear. Don't need a raincoat today, y'all. All right, so we got a Sunday, a Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. It's supposed to be clear, so all y'all at that faith conference, you good? It's all good. All right, it's gonna be nice. Amen. All right, Thursday, fr- Thursday, a little bit of uh, rain. Uh, Friday, definitely it's gonna pour down. But uh, you good for the most part of the week. All right, so definitely y'all at the uh, Living Word Faith Conference. What up? When it good last night? To the Bismarck, he set it off. All right, y'all. So, if you weren't there, get the tape. All right? That's all I got to say. All right, so here we go. Some music for you. Something to pep you up. We got The Champion by Mayhem. Thank you. 
not able, but I'm able to turn the table. Yes, I'm able to freak this rack. Still, they labeled me as rack. In fact, they claim they know my plight. My story differs, death, that's my dismissal. I'm not interested in getting it. I just bust rhymes for my father. Though you told me not to bother. The idea is limited. You said instead I should kick. Full guarantees to reach the masses with these. Don't they lyrics, please? I see the crown that's next that title. But it is not vital for me to have at my recital. Because I've been writing for God since 1982. You've been writing about us like this. That's only if I became cool. Who really plays the fool in the game of Russian roulette? It's those who choose to play in this gamble for your soul. Where you end up in stark cold, you're in a no win situation. And it's time to place your back. They wonder why do I do the things that I do? I do them to pursue the souls of the losses. I forget about the course, like Prince, forget about arguments.
them push you just to keep Sorrento. Here for the task at hand, staying to the dance floor, flux full of demand. In effect, we wreck like a teddy rump shaker. I love to talk about it. Can we do this later? No, don't you fret. I guess I get a bit too empty when the moment is full. CD cassette, OP on net. For Constantinople to Istanbul, so don't think, don't stop. Hesitation, can't even man with the sweet temptation. Ration, ration, two step drive. And we see you looking, so stop your hiding. Move your body, shake your body. Move your body, shake your body. Dance, move your body, shake your body. Move your body, shake your body. out that was a uh, I I got the clearance by Max One and this is Kathy for L U T G Radio. It's time for my piece, y'all. All right, so my piece. Normally it's uh, just strictly an opinion piece, but I'm gonna replace replace some facts with some faith. All right. So uh, one day I was in a back in the day I was in a foundations class. Um, I keep hearing say uh, Living Word. Okay, so I was in the foundation class at Living Word Christian Center. All right, so I was over there, right? 
uh, taking a foundation class, and um, I ran across this lady. Now, remind you, I don't believe that I can't do anything. I actually believe that I can do everything. So, I ran across this lady, and she was an older lady, and she had never, you know, taken a foundation class before. She was kind of new to church. Well, she she had been going to church all her life, but she never knew that she should take foundations or memorize scriptures. So anyway, she said, I can't memorize this scripture. I've tried and tried, and I just can't do it. I can't do it. And all her life, she's always said, I can't, I can't, I can't. So since that's what she said, that's what it was. She didn't put no faith behind it. And it wasn't until they told, okay, well, stop saying I can't and just say I can even though it may not seem like you can do it, just say it anyway. So she started doing that, and all of a sudden, she was able to remember the scriptures. So she memorized one, and she, we was all ecstatic for her, and then she did another one. Before you know it, she graduated from the class because she was able to remember all the scriptures, and she was able to do all the work that was needed for it. It wasn't a whole lot. I mean, it's ten scriptures. I mean, really, uh, I think it was about ten, but... Um, it, it really, it, it wasn't a lot. It wasn't a lot. And me, being like I am, I'm like, oh, I can do it in Spanish. <laughs> They're like, yeah, we don't speak Spanish. <laughs> but we got, we got the Spanish people working with the Spanish people. Go ahead, memorize it in Spanish. That's cool. <laughs> so anyway, whenever you want to memorize scriptures, first thing you want to say is, I can do it. I can do this. And then write it down on a piece of paper. It doesn't have to be a 3 by 5 card. I got notebook paper and just cut it into slits. So definitely do that and always believe that you can because you can. Amen. God always said, I am. He, he never said, I ain't. All right. All right. So we got Digital Saver by Midnight Orchestra. This is your Kathy. This is your Kathy. This is your girl Kathy for LUTG Radio. We got the altar call um, in about six minutes. I am Christ, I die for you, yet you choose 
not my way You shall be slain You betray Digital savior will appear No one is left to calm your fear You're digital That was Calculated Risk with a little bit of scratching by Braille. This is your girl, Kathy Brox, for LUTG Radio. And um, it's time for the altar call, y'all. Like I was saying earlier, when you have your shirt on backwards, which means you have your faith on backwards, you're going to feel a choking at your neck. You're going to feel restrained. You're going you're gonna to feel like you can't move, like you're not really yourself. And it's not until... You put your shirt on, correct, which means you get some faith, you get your life right, you, basically, you receive Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior, that you begin to feel freedom and, and, and the weight is lifted off. Because when you're in sin, it's not only that you have the shirt on back, which, which is the main thing because it's choking your neck, but you also have all this other baggage that you weren't meant to carry. 
but it's additional baggage. It's stuff that's not even yours. It's fear that's put into you. It's some of for some people it's sexual perversion. For other people it's alcoholism. For other people it's drugs. It's it's something. And those some things, all of that can be removed with the blood of Jesus. All of it. You can absolutely be one hundred percent free. When you receive Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior, I mean, that's just, that's the beginning, that's the end. And I want to give you an opportunity to receive Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior. And basically, all you have to do is, when, a, when you confess with your mouth that Jesus is Lord, and believe in your heart that uh, God raised him from the dead, you are saved. So, believe in that, and with this prayer confession, we're going to get you saved, Amen. All right, so here we go. Repeat after me. Lord, I know I am a sinner. I know I can't earn or buy my way into heaven. I want to know your pure love. Lord, I freely accept Jesus Christ as my Savior and Lord of my life. From this day forward, I give my life to you, Jesus. Direct me in all my ways and keep me on your righteous path. I have faith in the blood of Jesus. Set me in an atmosphere of learning in a Bible-based church. In your name, Jesus, thank you. Amen. I mean, it's really that simple. It's really that simple. I know, I know some of you guys are saying, well, is she going to say it in Spanish? Uh, not today. I, my Spanish is not that great, but I do want you to read the book of John, book of Juan, chapter 1, capitulo 1. No, see, my Spanish is not that great. I'm, I'm working on it. But read chapter 1. Um, you're right. I should not be saying my Spanish is not that great. I'm excellent in Spanish. Amen. Prayer confession going forward. I am and not I am not. But read the book of John chapter 1 verse 1. Uh, and read a chapter every day. And also go to facebook.com forward slash LUTG radio. And then that way um, you can find a, the link for find the church. And um, the services are in English and in Spanish in most of the churches. Alright. And uh, Polish too. Uh, so definitely do that and uh, what we're going to do is uh, we had a fundraiser coming up September uh, 14th which is this Friday and uh, the goal is to actually uh, put in Spanish programming so um, we'll have that for you amen and uh, we're just going to get it done we're going the goal is to translate or, I'm sorry not just to translate but to have the show in as many different languages as we can possibly do and nothing is impossible with Christ Jesus right so uh, the fundraiser starts so definitely you know go to the website I'm gonna put it on the Facebook and I'm gonna air it in a minute uh, but I want you to go there once I get everything I'm, I'm almost done I want you to go there go ahead and pick a perk make a donation and help me to uh, preach the gospel all over all right because we want to open all the, we want to go through all the open doors that God has, op God has opened it all right, so uh, come up with the next the next segment up is uh, the birthday segment. So definitely come back. I'll be uh, I'll tune it up again in about five minutes. All right.